Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who hath blessed us with all spiritual blessings in Christ Jesus. What are spiritual blessings? Spiritual blessings are not, I got promoted at work. Spiritual blessings in Christ is not, I got a raise. Spiritual blessings is not, I needed it to rain, and it did. Spiritual blessings is not, I found my car keys. That's not spiritual blessings. Spiritual blessings are all in Christ. They were given to you automatically at the time you were saved. And you know what that means? It means that you're no longer in Adam, but you're in Christ in every area that covers. And I'm not going to enumerate them. So let's keep reading it. According as He hath chosen us in Him before the foundation of the world. Oh, Brother Mike, He chose us in Him before the foundation of the world. Calvinists love to use that verse. But what they don't read is the rest of the verse. That He hath chosen us in Him, in Him. In who? Before the foundation of the world, that we should be saved. Oh, wait a minute, I misread that. He didn't choose us that we would be saved. He chose those of us who are in Him before the foundation of the world. He chose that we should be holy and without blame before Him in love. Having predestinated us unto the adoption of children by Jesus Christ to Himself. And you know what that means? God predestinated that this adoption is going to be part of what we're going to get in Christ. And there it is. Having predestinated us into the adoption of children. That means He chose before it ever happened that everyone who was in Christ was going to get that. According to the good pleasure of His will, that will based on His plan and purpose for His creation, to the praise of the glory of His grace, wherein He hath made us accepted in the blood, in whom we have redemption through His blood, the forgiveness of sins, according to the riches of His grace, wherein He hath abounded toward us in all wisdom and prudence, having made known unto us the mystery of His will, according to His good pleasure, which He hath purposed in himself. That's why I talked about his plan and purpose for his creation. And that means all of those things in that verse, God predestinated that everybody who was going to be in him was going to get. 